Do you have the the insurance? Okay. But I have to get a picture of it. It's through my dad. Okay. I don't have a hard copy. So like I said, you're going 60 and then right when I right before I hit my lights, you're traveling in like both lanes. Look like you were gonna flee. Yeah, I I didn't mean I didn't know you were an officer. I was his uh, insurance. Um, you didn't know you you literally drove right past me. Alright, here just hop out real quick so we can talk out here. Yeah, that'll work. Okay, why are you nervous? Because you're an officer. Why? Why are you nervous? Okay, here, come over here, send her here. Ms. Granger, how much alcohol have you consumed this evening? I haven't. No, nothing? No, sir. Okay, so you're being super, like, you're not looking at me, you're avoiding eye contact, um, kind of preventing me from smelling your breath emitting from your person, okay? But I smell inside the car. So, how much alcohol have you consumed? I haven't, sir. Nothing? Yes, okay. Everything okay? Yeah, you're just, like I said, an officer. It makes me nervous. Okay. That's why I'm not waiting for contact and all the other things. Okay, all right. So just let me adjust these lights real quick. I mean, you're going 60, and then before I hit my lights, you're traveling in both lanes there, well, and then. Just, I have a long way to go. Um, what do you mean? It's not that I'm driving particularly fast. It's just that I'm again I have a long way to go, and so I'm just trying to get home. Okay. All right. So let me just check your eyes, just to make sure you're safe to drive. Okay. All right. So just take a step to your left. Let's just stand right here. All right. Put your toes and heels together. Have you had any recent head injuries? No, sir. No. All right. Just put your arms to your side. All right. So follow, uh, what I want you to do is follow the tip of my finger with your eyes and your eyes only keeping your head directly straight. Do you understand that? You able to see my finger? You're not really following it. Follow, follow it all the way out, okay? You able to see it? No, no issues walking, turning or balancing? No, okay, all right. Um, Time for messing up. Let me just run your license real quick, okay? So I'm going to ask you again, how much alcohol have you consumed? None, you haven't consumed anything? Okay. No, okay, so I mean... You put me back on the 49 and tank 47 clear. Like I said, I smelt it inside the car. I mean, your your uh, actions, I mean, just, you're all, uh, just while speaking with you, I mean, you're super not looking at me, kind of avoiding, you're standing over there while I'm over here, and then uh, I smell it uh, emitting from your person while we're, while we're speaking, okay? Just give me a sec. 544 to come. Deal in Mexico. Go ahead. Fields. Where are the keys to the car? Fields, 10 I, I believe I turned it off when I asked you to turn it off. No, 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 I know, but where are the keys? They're still in the car. Still in the car? Okay. Yes. Okay. All right. Because, because what? All right, do you mind if I go get the keys? That's fine. Just that way we, we have this little area right here. All right, so just, uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll just go right here. All right, just come stand right over here. All right, just stand right here. All right. So you said you don't have any issues with your legs, walking, turning, or bouncing? No, sir. It's just, it's cold. I get it. It's a little cold out here. I'm shaking. It's, you're an officer, and it's cold. What, what does it have? I mean, don't get me wrong. You make, you make me nervous. Why, why do you make me, or why do I make you nervous? I don't, I don't need to explain that to you. You're just, you're an officer. Okay. It's cold, so I'm shaking. Yeah. No, I mean, I understand that it's a little bit cold. That's a means for your concern. No, I get that. So I get it that it's a little bit cold. I get it that you're concerned that I'm an officer and it makes you a little bit nervous, but at the end of the day, I gotta do my job and ensure you're safe to drive. I, I get that. Um, can I ask you what's happening next? Do you wanna do my 
more tests or is there another officer coming to do more tests or what do you yeah, so I just got two more tests administered. As long as I feel like you're safe to drive, then I'll cut you loose. Okay. What do you feel as of now? So, I mean, I know you've consumed some alcohol. How do you, how do you know that? Because I smell it emitting from your person. I smelt it inside the car. I smelt it while we're out here. So. Okay. All right. So come stand right over here. All right. And then just face that way. All right. Just put your toes and heels together. Do you have another jacket inside your car? Yes, but you do. I mean, I don't make a difference at this point. Well, I mean, you are you have a jacket on, but I'm wondering if you have another jacket that way because you say it's yes. cold out here. Yes, sir. Okay. Would you uh, do you want that other jacket to put on? No. That's... Are you sure? It's a little bit cold out here. Yes, sir. Yeah. Sure. Where is it at? It's in the back seat. May I get it? Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. You okay? Not cold at all. It's a little bit chilly out here. <laughs> it's a little bit chilly. Yes, I agree. You okay? Looks like you lost an earring. I, I did. You want to get that? No, it's not going to You what? Well, just get it in. I don't know if you want to just put it in your pocket or. I don't have a, yeah, I don't have a back for Okay. Just put it in your pocket. You can deal with it later. All right, here. Yes, sir. All right, so just stand right over here, right where my light is. All right, feel better with the jacket? I guess. Okay, all right, so just take a step to your left, that way you have more room. All right, put your toes and heels together. Put your arms to your side. All right, so there's gonna be an imaginary line from your left foot directly to the rear of your view, or to, uh, just directly in front of you. Okay. It's gonna be approximately the width of your shoe. So I'm gonna Are you? straight line. Yeah, so I'm just explaining it to you. So there's an imaginary line from your left foot directly in front of you. Are you able to imagine that line? It's approximately the width of your shoe. Yes, sir. All right, so now that your left foot's on that line, Miss Granger, go ahead and put your right foot directly in front, just like so. Go ahead and do that now. So put your, your left foot's on the line, put your right foot directly in front, just like I am. So keep your arms to your side, directly like I am. All right, so now that you're in that position, just maintain that position until I tell you to begin the test. So once I tell you to begin the test, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps on that imaginary line, heel to toe, keeping your arms to your side, looking down directly at your feet, and counting each step out loud. Once you get to the ninth step, you're going to leave your lead foot planted, you're going to take a series of small steps with your rear foot, and you're going to turn yourself back around and take nine heel to toe steps in the opposite direction. Nine, five, and nine, five. Correct. I'm going to demonstrate it. During this test, you're gonna keep your arms to your side, you're gonna look down directly at your feet, and you're gonna count each step out loud. Just pay attention. Left foot on the line, right foot directly in front, just like you are. Go ahead and put your right foot directly in front, just like, just like I am. All right, so just maintain that position. All right, just pay attention. One, two, three. I took three steps for demonstration purposes. You'll take nine. Once you get to the ninth step, lead foot planted, series small steps with your rear foot, turn your soft back around, nine heel toe steps in the opposite direction. One, two, three. Again, I took three steps, you'll take nine. Do you understand? Yes, sir. How many steps are you gonna take? Nine. Perfect. Nine steps forward, the turn just like I demonstrated, nine steps back. You're gonna keep your arms to your side, you're gonna look down directly at your feet, and you're gonna count each step out loud. Once, once you begin the test, do not stop until you're finished with the test. Do you understand? All right, give me one sec. Go ahead and get back in the instructional phase with your right foot in front of your left.
Offline. 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 All right, to your left. To your left. More to your left. And then just face me. All right, put your toes and heels together. All right, so this next test is gonna be the one leg stand. So once I tell you to begin, you're gonna pick up the leg of your choice, left or right, six inches off the ground, about the size of a Coke can. Both legs are gonna be straight. The foot they decide to pick up is gonna be parallel with the floor. Parallel, you know what parallel means? Uh, level, level to the floor. You're gonna keep your arms to your side, you're gonna look down directly at your feet, and you're gonna count uh, in a series of 1,000s. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, and so on and so forth until I tell you to stop. Just pay attention, I'm gonna demonstrate it. I'm gonna use my right leg, you can use your left or your right. Uh, I'll demonstrate it, but just just uh, just maintain that position. Just pay attention. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, 1,006, 1,007, 1,008, and so on and so forth until I tell you to stop. So you're going to look down directly at the foot that you decide to pick up, and you're going to count in a series of 1,000s until I tell you to stop. Do you have any questions? Would you like me to demonstrate it again? Give me one sec, okay? Whenever you're ready. Going to pick up where you left off. Go to pick up where you left off. Pick up where you left off. Let's just come right over here. All right, just stand right here. Just stand right here and then just face this way. Five, uh, 12. Go ahead and roll me a 46. And a case number for 444. Four, All right, so at this point, you're going to be under arrest for DWI, driving on influence, intoxicating liquor, and or drugs. Why What's in your mouth? Take you so long to say it. Because I wanted to put the handcuffs on first. What's in your mouth? A big fuck you. Nothing in my mouth. Okay, well, let me check it. Lift up your tongue. All right. So on my watch, hold on, hold on. No, I know, but. No, so don't put your shit around me. All right, so on my watch, 0050. Come right over here. Right over here. You tell me what that means, though. That just means that I checked your mouth and there was nothing in there. There's nothing in this jacket. All right, let's have a seat. Do you have anything in the vehicle that you need? Cell phone, wallet. What the fuck does that mean? I need all of it. I need all of it. Okay, that's what, why I'm asking the, you. Yeah, that's why I'm telling you. I need all of it. So why why would you ask? I need all of that shit. Okay. Okay. Uh, no, you can just keep it in the car. I guess I'll ask her. Yeah, there was a bunch of uh, weed in the middle console. Could you uh, pop the trunk? There's a tire back here. Dang. 
No, babe, she had one. One point. Yeah, one point. Let's go. She's in the yoga too. Jack on that there? Yeah. Listen to me, I'm about to say something important. You are under arrest for DWI, driving while under influence, intoxicating liquor. The New Mexico Implied Consent Act requires you to submit to a breath test to determine the alcohol content of your blood. After you take our test, you have the right to choose an additional independent test. If you choose to take this additional independent test, you have the right to a reasonable opportunity to arrange for a physician, a licensed nurse, or a laboratory technician or technologist who is employed by a hospital or physician of your own choice to perform an additional chemical test. The cost of this additional test will be paid by the law enforcement agency, the New Mexico State Police. Do you agree to take our test? What I'm asking for is a breath test. Right now, we want a breath test. It's going to be back at the office. All right, so I'm going to read this next portion to you. Okay. I cannot, I'm just going to read it to you. I cannot force you to take our test, but if you refuse, you will lose your New Mexico driver's license or non-resident operating privilege for one year. If you are convicted in court of driving while under the influence, you may also receive a greater sentence because you refuse to be tested. Do you understand? You're saying I'll get an upgrade. Correct. Okay. Your, your right to speak to an attorney or remain silent does not apply to the requirement of New Mexico law that you take a breath test. Motherfucker, give me the... Do you now agree to be tested? No, whatever. I need a verbal yes or no. Yes, sir. Okay. Fuck. All right. You what? I'm just going to be back at the office. So just sit tight. We're going to go back to the office. You going to wait? Oh, sure. All you, right. You oh, shoot, yeah. All right, Miss Granger. Just exit real quick. Let's just walk right over there. It's open. Oh, thank you, man. Here, I think things going to pull this way. I'm going to go through here, I guess. Right, maybe straight ahead, straight ahead. No, is that uh, straight down? I really don't. Here, give me a sec. Here, stop right there. Um, go around that corner first door on the right, and you'll see it back in the corner. Okay, to your right. Okay, right. all right, perfect. Thank you. All right, straight ahead. Hey, what's up, man? in this 
possibly in this room? Yeah. Okay. You just go have a seat right over here. I just, uh, the, the dispatch guy told me. No, I'm just um, Looks like there's a couple here. Okay, cool. Yeah. Cool, thank you. Sure. I'm right here if Breath test, correct. You blow it in now. Uh, not yet, not yet. I. If I don't want to, if I don't want to do that, then then what? Then you'll lose your I license. Better, I better get a lawyer. Is that what that means? Say that again. I need to get a lawyer. So you could get a lawyer either way, but if you uh, if you refuse this test, then it's going to be an automatic mm -hmm. aggravated DWI. When did you get your other one? Was it recent? Why don't you guys fucking know that? Well, I do. I could just look okay, in my well, system, but I don't have my laptop right here. System. Okay. Good. Just a simple question. No. You guys. Yes, you guys. You've never dealt with me, man. No. I've been cool with you the whole time. One. Okay. We'll just take a deep breath in, blow constantly like you're gonna blow up a balloon. Alright, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Alright, stop. Can we So you have to provide one more sample and then we're, I have to transport you back to the office. So this isn't my office, this is UNM's office. So it's literally right up the road. And then uh, Carlisle and I-40. And then uh, I'll put you in the holding cell. Do you have to pee? Yeah. Okay. So right after this, it's going to be another minute, minute and a half, two minutes. Yes, you could pee after that. Same thing. Deep breath in and then just blow constant. All the, way until, all the way until the tone stops. What's up? Point one four, point one four. So just under um, aggravated DDBI. So it'll just be a regular DDBI. Yeah, just over, that's what aggravated it. All right, zero, zero. Uh, one four. The time is an hour off on that. Yeah. So I'm just gonna make a copy of this. Make a copy of that. All right, come on over here. Give me a sec. Here, wait right there. Let me see where the restroom is. I've never been in here. Um, where's the restroom? Yeah. And then, is, is there? Do you guys have a copy machine that way I could just make a copy of the the logbook and the copy machine and radio? Okay. And the restroom's right there by the drinking fountain. Okay. Here, just wait right here. Let me just get this. Here, come over here. Just wait right here.
All right. So just go right here to the left, just like we came in. To the right. No, no, we're good. Just go straight ahead. Um. Okay, wait right here. Sorry, Here, just face this way, and then I'll take off the cuffs. Yeah, go ahead. One four, one four. Really? Yeah. It's walking pretty steady. Eh. 